there's an enemy base there? Affirmative, General. Good luck. Welcome to Sonus, everyone. Now, this is actually a really, really unique stage in my honest opinion, and <clears throat> I honestly love the music and the design on this stage. I think it's just incredibly fun to play on, and admittedly, it's kind of an insane stage. Score requirement, 250 points for the medal. I don't make this up. You need a load of points to get the medal on this stage. Now, the gimmick of this stage are these spotlights. If they spot you, there will be a lot more enemies, but whenever you shoot one, they won't give off a hit plus two addition. So, I'm not sure if it's possible or not to get it without the spotlights, but I always prefer shooting them all. And in order to go to the next stage, you actually have to shoot them all. So, basically, use a saying, <coughs> gotta shoot them all. And you'll remember that for the rest of your life, basically. Now, this is an additionally kind of annoying stage as well. Because, A, you don't really want, you kind of have those spotlights to worry about. And at the same time, you still need a hell of a lot of points to get the medal. There are a lot of enemies here, but even still, you need a lot of points to get this medal. <clears throat> Now, this area here actually kind of <clears throat> is actually one of the toughest parts of the level, in my honest opinion. Just because of the way that some of these spotlights are set up here, because... Hey, oh, shoot, shoot, shoot! Oh my god, how did I just do that? How did I just do that? Now we have this other thing that's like this weird dragon thing that... <clears throat> yeah, because it's a thing and a thing and a thing and... Yeah, I clearly can't talk right now. I believe we have a midway point coming up in a sec. I hope we have a midway point. Okay, now like Bill, you can shoot the hell out of Cat and she won't really care too much. Okay, well I'm well over halfway through what I needed for the points. I don't know actually how, because this is actually a stage that gives me a lot of trouble whenever I try to get the medal on it. And <clears throat> I also love the design and the concept of this stage. It definitely feels like a truly, it's a unique stage, and I simply put love it for that reason. <clears throat> now, shoot! Oh crap, I did not do that. I have to kill myself now, and I have a freaking huge life bar. Um, yeah, this isn't gonna be easy, because... <clears throat> I have to kill myself, basically. You got an enemy on your tail. Uh, damn. Should be better, guys. And as you can see here, this is all the guys coming after. I have, the reason I have to kill myself is because you can't go the <clears throat> to um sector Z, which I need to record next, anyways, go. unless you actually. Do the mission accomplished path, which as you can figure out is not get spotted by these spotlights. So I'm gonna have to kill myself. Thankfully, there was a twin laser right in this area here. So I'm not too complaining about or too complaining about that. But still, that's kind of annoying. The reason I didn't want to just restart the mission is because of how many points I already had. <clears throat> <clears throat> because this is a stage that typically does give me a lot of trouble, and with the amount of points I've had, I definitely wasn't willing to go back to the beginning of the stage again. And of course, gives me a bomb. I kind of do need some bombs, though, because I did waste a bit. And uh, the stage's boss is actually really unique, too. I love this spot, stage's boss. <clears throat> Just because it's actually a truly unique boss in this game standard, actually. Like, I'm not saying I don't think any of the other bosses in this stick game are unique. What the heck was that? That was a load of crap, if you ask me, and I'm surprised I didn't lose any of my wins. If it was expert mode, I would have lost my- I would probably be dead from that, because... Yeah, expert mode, you lose your wins a lot faster. <clears throat> Anyways... 
<clears throat> I personally really love the music in this level too. I wish I could actually hear it so I could tell you like that you should listen to it, but yeah, I'll, I'll let you guys listen to it actually just because it's so good. Now, I'm actually. These guys don't quit! Okay then, now, not really what I wanted to hit there. Okay, well there's this like small little extra section towards the end here. I should be able to get the remaining amount of points here. Falco helps you out as well. And, yes, I'm at the end of stage two. And I have enough points for the medal, and I admittedly am not bad at the boss this stage either. So, <clears throat> It's just the next stage that I'm concerned about, because the next stage is really tough to get a medal on, <clears throat> as was this stage. But anyways, now we have to fight a boss that I can't remember what his name is, although it's actually a really funny name, if I'm not mistaken. Now, for what this boss is, you actually have to use bombs on it. Now, I believe in order to, what you have to do is blow off each of these uh, exhaust valves first. And everything that this boss shoots out, well, each projectile this boss shoots out, gives off <coughs> bombs in order to fire back at it. So it's a really unique fight, I'll admit to this. I admittedly really like this boss a lot. Now, <coughs> the boss will try to submerge the crane, or try to use the crane, and you actually have to blow the crane off too, right here. It may not be easy to do with just one bomb, but... <coughs> Don't worry, you can still have multiple attempts at- You've gotta be kidding me! How did I lose my wing from that? Okay, well that thing's gone again. Couldn't have said it better myself, Peppy. Okay, the crane's gone now, it looks like. Yep. I don't really got much else left better. And of course, so I horrifically miss at that. <clears throat> Come on, can I please actually shoot this thing properly here? Okay, good. I sh blew that thing off there. And now, basically, this guy goes apeshit crazy and tries to go like, all out at you, but he's really not too hard. <clears throat> you may take a bit of damage off of it, but in the end. That was it for Zonus. <laughs> All around fantastic level. I love the atmosphere and the music and pretty much everything about Zonus. Especially the fact that you get a lot of points for it too. That's another thing I like about it. It's actually not the highest medal score, but it's the second highest. <clears throat> Believe it or not, there is still one stage that requires even more. So, there we go, 254 points there, we got, I think, like, three lives, I think. I couldn't, I didn't actually see what... Yeah, join back next time for Sector Z, a very tough stage.